If you're running into Navian error code E004, don't freak out because fortunately some error codes like this happen a lot more than you think and technicians who are equipped in dealing with these error codes can have issues like this fixed promptly so you can get back to enjoying your endless hot water. So stick around as we dive into how to fix Navian error code E004. <laughs> Here at Monkey Wrench, we've spent 15 plus years diagnosing and addressing tankless water heater error codes in the field. There isn't much we haven't seen, especially with Navian. Before we break down what Navian error code E004 means, if you're interested in learning more about your Navian tankless water heater, check out our Navian tankless water heater guide that's linked below that has so much info on all things about your Navian tankless water heater, including other error codes. Full disclaimer, resolving the error code does require professional assistance to ensure system functionality. While it can be a drag to have to call for help, the alternative is many articles and videos that will tell you that you can simply unplug and plug your tankless water heater back in to resolve the error code. This is essentially the equivalent of unplugging a car battery to get rid of a check engine light, but the underlying issue will still be there. Well, stick around because we're not here to put a band-aid on it, we're here to get to the root cause. Hey, if you're new to this channel, consider subscribing as we're constantly adding new videos every week on all things plumbing, heating, and air. Now, let's jump in. What does Navian error code E004 mean? If Navian error code E004 pops up on your tankless water heater, it means your unit is experiencing false flame detection. When you run into this issue, the sensor that picks up light from flames is not detecting a flame. While this is one of the more common Navian error codes, it is less frequent than others. There are a couple of different causes for Navian error code E004. For instance, this error code can trigger due to a blockage in the venting system. It doesn't just stop there though. If you have a blockage, it can short the onboard circuit board, which is what will ultimately cause false flame detection. On the other hand, if there's no blockage, you likely have an issue with the heat exchanger, such as a leak. So how do you fix Navian error code E004? Because this issue is slightly more involved in terms of diagnosing and potential fixes, it's best to leave the heavy lifting for a professional. After your technician arrives at your home, they'll thoroughly inspect your Navian tankless water heater and your entire plumbing system to ensure the issue is isolated to your tankless water heater. This process will rule out any other potential issues causing the larger problem. If the error code is triggered due to a blockage, your technician will clear the blockage. Your technician may find that the blockage caused the onboard circuit board to short. If this is the case, the technician will sort out the circuit board and have your Navian tankless water heater up and running in no time. However, your technician may not spot a blockage, leading them to examine your unit's heat exchanger closer. Typically, if the issue isn't caused by a blockage or a circuit board, it means there's a leak in the heat exchanger. If this is the case, your technician will need to replace or rebuild your heat exchanger. An easy way to prevent leaks in your heat exchanger is yearly maintenance. This process will clear buildup in your heat exchanger and prevent blockages from forming, which allows your Navian tankless water heater to run its best without issues. Performing yearly maintenance also keeps your tankless water heater under warranty. Some manufacturers require log maintenance by certified technicians to keep the warranty intact. So we've covered what Navian error code E004 means and how to resolve the issue. Now you can confidently pick up the phone and talk to a technician to explain the issue. If you live in Los Angeles County or a surrounding city and need help with an error code, visit our online scheduler to book a consultation or maintenance call. If you found any of the information in this video helpful, make sure to like and subscribe as we're constantly adding new videos on all things plumbing, heating, and air.